Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are excited to announce yet again after another update that Employee Training Program is back up and running, but with a caveat. So let's get into it. So Employee Training Program was updated a lot quicker than we thought it would be actually. He was really on it this time and I reinstalled it uh, after I uninstalled it before because it wasn't working and all of my, my people's levels are exactly back where it was. They still retain the ability to pick up multiple boxes. Plus, they have the added benefit now of having all of the fixes and changes that the new restockers got in the newest update. So these guys are hyper efficient. I mean, they, they get it done. They get it done quickly. So what we're going to do basically is I'm just gonna have a day run. Uh, I'm not gonna buy anything. I'm gonna let the day go. My inventory is completely full and stocked. I have uh, a full amount of everything back here. As you can see, all of the places are completely full uh, and we're gonna just watch them do their thing on a time lapse. Uh, see if anybody gets stuck, if anybody kind of gets caught up on anything or whatever, they should still work uh, significantly better than they did before. They shouldn't be locking up or anything. So uh, let's let's actually take a look at that and see how it goes. And then we'll address this situation afterwards. So we'll go ahead and open the store and we're just going to kind of let this thing go. We're going to put it on two times, three times speed. Three times should be good. And actually, let's turn on the lights too, just in case. All right, let's watch them work. Just wanted to highlight this comment from a user whose name is not appearing for some reason. I'm not sure why that is, but it is what it is. Uh, I really appreciate this comment. I like getting comments like this. This is a reason why I started doing tutorials on mods and stuff like this in the first place. I was hoping they would be helpful for people because I know this is not as easy for others. And to be perfectly honest, I started this looking for mods, uh, videos and tutorials myself, and I really couldn't find any that were useful. So I decided to make my own. So uh, I'm really glad to hear that this is helping you guys. Uh, messages like this are what keep me going for sure. So uh greatly greatly appreciate it thank you so much all right the day is done and the restockers seem to be working just fine although i have on magic restocker i know that's not a really good test but it actually does help out because it keeps them all in the same place so if they do get stuck we'll be able to see it happen here so yeah it looked like they got through the night with no problem no uh no customers were complaining that any items were missing which means that they were very quickly uh filling these shelves back up uh without any problems so real quick let's go ahead and open our market we'll hit this to fill our inventory by the way this is working again that'll be another video <laughs> but let's go ahead and fill our inventory and let's see how fast and efficiently they clear this mess up so let's watch them put these boxes away. Now these are high level restockers. I leveled them up quite a bit. So they're, look at this, look at this. Wow, <laughs> that is nuts, man. Yeah, they cleaned that up real fast with little to no effort. So there you go, it's working just fine. Uh, the one thing I did want to point out though, here's, the, here's where we talk about the problem. Now obviously your main restockers plus these guys, uh, your cashiers or whatever, you obviously know that they're going to be set up and working properly since the mod has been updated. But since then, we have the addition of two more restockers. And initially I was just like, okay, cool. They're gonna work, level them up, maybe spend some money to power level them. You probably don't wanna do that. And I'm gonna tell you why. So as you can see, these guys are all 40. And then these guys are level 13. So let's save our game. We're gonna quit to desktop. And the reason we're quitting to desktop and not to main menu is because sometimes when you quit the main menu in this game, it causes some issues when you try to load back up. So we're just gonna quit all the way to desktop and then reboot, especially when you're using mods. It might not be necessary for everybody to do, but it's a precaution that I take now just, just because I just don't wanna deal with it. Okay, we are back booted up and looks like they are level one now. Mm. Before they were 13, now they're level one. So that's a little problem. It doesn't affect your original guys because obviously these guys are here. And I don't know, like this could be a simple issue of the fact that the person who makes this mod might not play this game very often anymore. Like they probably got like other things to do. They may not be playing this game. So they probably accounted for making sure that these guys were fixed and everything was fine. But I don't think they took into account the two new extra ones that you can hire, uh, which is very possible, or it just could be a glitch or an error. So uh, 
I'll, I'll send this video over to them so they can see and uh, we'll see if there's a way to fix them. The only suggestion I can give you now is if you have two extra employees like this, do not spend money on leveling them. You can let them level through a play session and if you quit, they're gonna reset or whatever, that's fine. Just deal with it for now until it gets fixed, but don't spend money on them. Do not spend money to level them up. It'll it'll just go in the garbage, you know, so you don't wanna do that. Otherwise, like I said, the mod is back up and running uh, and it is working at least to the capacity it was before with the added addition of the new stuff that they added for the restockers and them being significantly more efficient. Um, outside of that, we have this other issue that is either going to just be an issue or it's gonna get fixed also sometime soon. So just be on the lookout for that. And yeah, that's it. That is the update. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this video was enjoyable and informative. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one.